what's up everybody and today I am back with another video the jet going back on in the background which is actually my ps4 so that's what y'all have been hearing but today we gotta escape from these ugly little creatures that were trapping onto my back in part one so this is part two so we need to sprint out of here meow to attract enemies why in the world would I want to attract them? That does not make any sense. Okay, well, it's too late, so I can't even go back down even if I wanted to. Ah! Okay, we made it past, so that's good. Never freaking mind. We surely did not make it past. Well, we got a long ways to go, so we better get hurried it up. Ow! I got the moves, son. I got the moves. Wait, what? Are y'all climbing up here? Oh, thank goodness. Alright, we up here now. <sighs> Bro, I just got scared by a freaking can. Remember that. I don't know how I just did that, but city is full of neon. It wasn't always this way. There used to be strict energy caps, especially in the slums. But people couldn't handle the constant darkness. One day someone lit up rainbow lamps, neon signs all over the house. That person was taken away and never seen again. But people saw hope, and not long after that, everyone started putting lots of lights in their homes. There was nothing the, op the officers could do. It was a way for people to see colors again, like on the outside. I think it helped. Okay, yeah, I literally need more memories than that. Ah, oh, go up there. Well, what? I guess we'll just go up here. Oh, it was a way to boost it. Okay, I get it, I get it. <laughs> We're not gonna take a million years to that again. Oh, darn it. Crap, it's not close enough. Don't wanna end up rolling it off the edge. There we go. Oh my gosh. Ah, oh, there we go. And now we're good. So let's just go up here and let's take a wild guess. Ah. Bro, this looks like the upside down in Stranger Things, bro. Where's the tower? Wait, are we already like almost here? Oh my gosh, bro. What the? No, what? I can't. I can't just parkour my way over there. What am I gonna do? No, what? Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my god! Okay, so we all saw how that went. So let's see if I can attract them from all the way over here. Okay, well I guess not. Okay, and we can't even get on top of that gate. Hack door? There's no way I'm gonna have enough time to do all this. 
Wait, if I hack the door, it's gonna open it for them. What did, what did this just do? Yeah, because if I go over here, then they're gonna come over here too. What if I hack it again? Oh, let's go. Oh, W. Can't get over here now, huh? Bro, I still cannot believe that my character full on died, bro. It's the first time, bro. It's good to know that we finally passed those annoying things, bro. Oh, well, the thing is right over there because there surely is more. I know y'all are here. Y'all can't fool me. So I don't like these random sounds, bro. Oh, whoa, my gosh. Did not know that we were that close. How are we gonna get in? And get to the top of it. Okay, I guess we could do that. Oh, there's a little like vent right there. What? So we died once, and I'm pretty sure it won't be the last time. Yep, it definitely won't be the last time. Okay, so pathway over there. Maybe we can get over to there in time. I'm just gonna sprint for dear life. Yep, they know they know I'm here, they know I'm here. Oh what they can get up here? <laughs> oh no, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done for. I'm done for. Ah! Okay, come on. We we will pass this today. Get down, get down! correctly one second down and then I'm dead bro oh my gosh we are so dead we are so dead we are so dead why would you go down you dumb little cat why what were you thinking why you dumb cat? Okay, don't mess this up again, bro. The reason we got killed, it was all your fault. So I started to panic. No, 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 don't go down again, bro. I'm so scared right now. Neocorp. They were responsible for for waste management. As trash from the upper levels overloaded the slums, they tried to develop a bacteria to dissolve it. After the humans disappeared, that bacteria mutated, growing, eating way more than trash. And now we have Zerks. Let's go. Okay, uh, so like your character here buddy you know like robot helper type thing going on but you need to help me whenever I'm about to get killed like that not gonna hack 
Hack it. Yes. <sighs> okay. So I didn't know that there were hacks on both doors. Oh, bro. There's only evaporate, bro. Uh. Um. Would you mind uh, telling me, you know, like where to go and stuff? Because. You, but I don't know where to go. You're not really helping. There's like two left, bro. They all evaporated. Wait, I know what I'm supposed to do. Why? What are your game plans here, cat? Bro, how many of these things are there? <gasps> Bro. Only a few more ways until we get there. And I'm still terrified as heck. What is this? Can this like kill all of them, please? Oh, what? Oh, no. 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 Can you not? I got it again. Oh heck no, nah, bro. I'm dead. I'm dead. Inside of there, bro. So there's really like no way we can escape. We literally just have to run for dear life. I remember the good old days when I said that this game isn't hard, but I didn't put that in the video. This junk! Woo! Get down! Get down! That's right! Oh yeah! Oh, I'm feeling good! Yeah, all of y'all better be jumping off right now because I am going to reach the top of this tower and I'm gonna do whatever we have to do. <laughs> Uh, okay, so we're just gonna have to uh, do some of this, and yeah, we're good. Here it is. Put the transceiver on the in on this antenna. Let's go! Let's go!
Yes, sir. <gasps> bro, y'all do not know how good that makes me feel, bro. We did it. We did it. Okay, what's left after? Because I don't want to get attacked by those zerks anymore. Look, the view is beautiful from here. I remember now the city. It was meant to be a shelter. Dang. Those, those look like stars, but they're only lights marking the hermetic roof sealing off the city. Humankind built this shell to protect themselves from the outside, but it came at a cost. Nobody can get out. The outside was a disaster, completely barren, un unlivable, and dangerous. But if you come from there, it must mean it's safe again. And my promise wasn't just to go to the out to the outside; it was to open the city. I still don't understand why some memories are coming back and others aren't. But I'm certain now this is my purpose. I have to open the city. Come on, let's go back and find Momo now that we've connected the transmitter. We should be able to get help. Okay, let's go. Here goes nothing. Wee! Dang, bro, the view is beautiful from up here, bro. This cat has been through way too much. The slums part two. Ah, yes, that feels nice. That that feels nice. Momo, Momo, where are you at? Hey, <laughs> what? Hey, get me out of this. Get me out of this. Get get me out of this. Get this off of me. What the heck? What the heck? I can't control it. I can't control it. Okay, nice little detail there, creator. Yes. All right. Now it's time to find Momo. Translate that. City has a cylindrical shape of about 450 meters and a diameter. There is a level above ours. The city seems to have a ceiling. If I believe my books, a big blue sky is hidden behind. Look, a note. Little outsider, if you're reading this, that means you're still alive. Excellent. Wasn't alive for like three times. It took some equipment. I took some equipment to the bar to take advantage of the antenna. Come meet me there. I've locked the window, but the code to open it is quite simple. It is. All right, y'all, and I'll see y'all in the next one. Deuces. Nah, bro, bro, what the heck? Be careful, it is case sensitive. See you at the bar, Momo. That must be the code for the window near the entrance. Let's go. Here's the lock for the window. The code was, mm, it was an H, I think. Error, wrong key. Whoops, my bad. Okay, let's try that again. And then it was O, or was it a zero? Let's see. Success! It worked. Momo is at the bar waiting for us. Wait, oh, this is the bar. Okay. What's up, Momo? Hey, little furball. Come here, I managed to get a signal. Gosh, Momo. <laughs> No, wrong chair, wrong chair. Let me see if I can get this thing working. Hmm? 
I've almost got it. Hello? Can anyone hear me? <laughs> Hello? Yes, we can hear you. We're, we're from the slums. We're looking for a way out and... Wait, is that you, Zabalzar? What? Momo? I, I can't believe it. I'm so happy to hear your voice, Zabalzar. Where are you? Are the others okay? Yes! We <laughs> safe! We found a way out! <laughs> no way. Hello? Do you still hear me? You have to get through the sewers to reach us! Very dangerous! Zerks everywhere! Oh, come on! Sewers? Hello? Uh, sewers? How? Hello? Darn it! We lost the signal! I can't believe it! Zabalzar is alive! He and the other outsiders managed to get up to the sewers? The sewers are the most dangerous place in the slums! But if the vaults are made it, there must be a way. Hmm? You'll never get past sewers. It's infested with zerks. They'll make a quick meal out of you, especially you, little one. Many tried their luck in the past. It it doesn't end well. Anyway, I warned you, your business is none of my business. There's already Zerks everywhere. Mm, seems, or same as, or whatever his name is, I don't know how to pronounce that. His father, Doc. What? used to be a great scientist. He was working on some new weapon to fight the Zerks. A few years ago, he went off to test the device and never came back. Whatever that says has never been the same since. Dang. Don't listen to blank. <laughs> He's just scared. Like I was, if Doc built a weapon, that's our ticket to join the Outsiders. In his notebook, Doc mentioned a secret lab a few times. That must be where he was working on it. There might be a clue in blank apartment. Come on, follow me. All right. I'm cleaning the porch of my shop again. Stop playing over my shop, you clumsy rascal. <laughs> yeah, that definitely was them. Who are you? Bruno? <laughs> I swear that's Bruno. Come on, Blank. Open the door. You know your father would have wanted to, uh, to help us. Well, that was to be expected. This situation is pretty tough on Blank. <laughs> he doesn't want to hear about the outsiders anymore. He won't help me, but you. I think I have an idea. Oh no. <laughs> Here, take Doc's notebook and show it to blank. Bet, it contains a lot of information that will hopefully act as, as an electroshock. Find the secret lab, little outsider. I'm going back to the bar to try to reestablish communication with the others. What are you doing in here? I told you get through the sewers. I told you getting through the sewers is a suicide mission. Leave me be. And so, what's this? 
Wait, is this my papa's? Oh wow, I never knew. There's a secret room here in our flat, but where? I don't know. Yeah, I'll just show him on music sheet. <laughs> I don't play an instrument, sorry. Oh crap, what else are we supposed to have? A secret lab right under my nose. Maybe there are clues hidden somewhere around here? My gosh. Time will tell. Hope you don't mind if I just knock all your pictures over. Oh, what? There's a code. I never noticed a digicode before. How did I miss it? I have no idea what the password could be. Time will tell. Time will tell! Okay, so it's four digits, so. Wait, which, which hand are we talking about? Are we talking about the long one or the short one? So, two, five, one, one, two, five, one, one. Let's try it. Oh, I'm such a genius! <laughs> yes, sir! <clears throat> All right, what's in here? Ooh, he has his Eric's locked up. Yeah. Poo, poo. Oh, poo. Stupid. Robots, new headline, Zerk, are officially no longer under control. They now eat metal? Bro, what? They eat metal too, bro? I've never seen this room. I can't believe he managed to hide it from me all this time. These blueprints, they must be for his Zerk weapon. Papa was always so secretive with his work. He told me the weapon was working in theory, but it needed a real life test. He went outside the slums and he never came back. Must be tough on you, kid. Death looks or blueprint concept. Oh my gosh, you're going real fast. Can I even scroll up? Oh. Concept, light-based handgun, low priority, visual appearance, size, deceivable emitted, or whatever that says, I don't know. High priority test in real condition, objective 20 zerk destroyed per second. Ooh. Yes, sir. Please. <laughs> Observations, cute sounds, but never friendly. Old bacteria. I of human time, eat all kinds of materials. Total vision in the dark. React to the in re react to the intense light. Wait, no, no, no! I could have gone up there. Ah, crap! Come on. No, wrong way. Jeez. Broken tracker? Hey, we're trying to talk to you. Mister? Find anything interesting in here? Uh, a broken tracker. Wait, I remember that. That's his tracker. Papa always used that tracker to keep an eye on where I was. Maybe we can reverse it to find where he was. How? I can't believe my papa might still be alive. I missed him so much. You need a weapon for the Zerks, right? My papa definitely took one with him. We just need to repair the tracker so we can find him. Someone in the slum should be able to help. Come with me, I'll open the door for you. 
Okay. Bet. No joke, that took me like the longest time to find that. It was actually a little bit embarrassing. You gotta fix that tracker, you're resourceful. Maybe you can find someone in the slums to help. Yeah, but who? Announcement, I am looking for any sheet music to play the guitar to add some um, and mine. If you find any, bring them back to me. I'm near the elevator. Near the elevator? Hey, but whose help am I looking for? Barter man, super spirit laundry, grandma clothing, and Elliot programming. Wait, Elliot programming, where is that? Red idea, don't go over there. Rip humans. <laughs> humans were the first residents around here. Seems that they're all dead now. Dang, what do you think? It feels like being dead. I know it's silly coming from me, but are they actually at peace? Well, will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry, I didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. So, today's yesterday, tomorrow's tomorrow. Oh, yesterday, today, right? Time is weird. We don't age like our soft one ancestors. We are trapped here forever. You can fix your tracker at that address. That kid Elliot who lives there. Real tech was. No dip. I'm trying to find Elliot. That guy's cleaning the paint again. She sure is making use of all that detergent. What's this thing, a jacker? I don't know about high tech stuff. Try the bar. The bar? Cry, bro, where's the bar, where's the bar? Are you Elliot? No, you're not Elliot. Put on me the scarf. Isn't it wonderful? She knits so well. Your tracker's in bad shape. Bartender might help you find someone who can fix it. You're new around here. What can I do for you? Go ahead and jump. What a beautiful object and rare too. I know a guy who fixes stuff like this. He's very talented. Just a little, well, you'll see. His name's Elliot. His office is just left of here, near Grandma's shop. There, there are signs all over his door. So it's to the left of here. Elliot? Can I meet with you? Um. That's true. You're here for Elliot. He's just over there. You should show that to Elliot. Uh, I'll take that if you don't mind. Elliot, my dude. Yes, can I help you? Oh wow, that's a great tracker. I recognize your model. It's a <laughs> VR2000. You can track anyone with this little gadget. May I? I know how to repair it, but when I'm trembling like this, I can't use my keyboard. I don't know if I'm sick or something, but I definitely don't feel right. I can't work when I'm shivering like this. I think I need a blanket to be able to fix your tracker. Remember. This tree is a, is a scientific marvel. It's remarkable that a human, I can <laughs> found a way to create plants that thrive without sunlight. Organic life requires trees to purify the city's air. Robots don't need it, but they take care of them anyway. 
It's what the humans would have wanted. Elliot's hype, bro. I don't know what these big words are, man. Not many of those anymore. It got passed down from our ancestors. If you want him to go back to work, you better bring him some cloth. That will butter him up. We're programmed to be slaves, but since <laughs> days, we have a soul. Hope one day the outsiders will find the exit of this. Ugh! Momo. Oh. <laughs> Well, let me play a masterpiece. Ah, so beautiful. Natural talent. <laughs> I do love knitting. So far, I've knitted 478 miles of scarves. It's something to do. If you bring me some electric cable, I could make you a whatever that says you inspire me but it's not easy to find the right materials around here grandma closing I do Music sheet? I don't play instruments, sorry. It's okay. You can leave the Guardian. Said it was... It's okay, you can leave. The Guardian said it was no Zerks. Please don't act like a child. I'm not gonna hurt you. What the heck? You look lost, what do you need? I go up there, there's nothing there. You really thought you'd take the elevator? Never seen that thing work, and I'll be 374 years old tomorrow. marketplace hello I'm the merchant of the market you give me something I'll give you uh, something in exchange it's as simple as that this is an ancient relic a testament to the talent of our ancestors it will cost you three energy energy drink cans I can't do less nope sorry that's not enough This is a set of electric cable, the best of the market. I'll exchange this for a super spirit d detergent. That's the best I can do. I'm not putting that in the video. Can I please get another energy drink, bro? Finally some rest, bro. Oh wait, you play music. Hello, I'm a musician, but I don't have any songs. Untitled. This tune contains exactly 44 notes. Okay, you're done. <laughs> okay, oh, thank you for that music, I'll practice. Do you think you can find more? Mildly important information. This one was composed by a known algorithm.
so peaceful, man. Oh, this is a music sheet. A masterful piece of art, of art of a very renowned artist. It will cost you one energy drink. Can. Can't do less. Here you go. Thank you. So maybe we can find a turgeon in here. Yes, sir. Woohoo, let's go. All right, now we just need to find the trouble of uh, finding that man again. Hello again, what do you want now? Okay, and then, here you go. Yes, sir. Yes, oh my gosh, finally found you. Oh, little one, do you have any electric cable for me? I'd love to make uh, whatever that says for you, but I need that cable. <coughs> Thank you, my dear. I'll get to work right away. Okay. Yes, sir. There you go, little one. It'll suit you well. Okay, yeah, so it should be this one. Let's go. Don't worry, the tracker is safe here with me. But I can't work on it unless I have cloths to keep me warm. I can't focus. Oh, where did you find this? It's amazing. Let me try it on. Let's go. Look, no tremors. I'm able to work again. Thanks. Now I can definitely fix your tracker. Let me take a look. I just gotta give it an update and one more thing. Voila. Fix tracker. Let's go. There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you are looking for. Thank you, bro. Let's go. Okay. I don't remember what your name was though, like Sam Samus. <laughs> sure, we'll just call him that. Samus, we'll call you that. But I'm coming to find you and we will get this fixed track or work. You will find your papa. Did you manage to fix that tracker? You did it? You fixed it. Well done. Give it here. Please would be nice after all my hard work. Okay. We got a pink. Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it. Let's follow the tracker. Maybe we'll find where my papa went. Okay. Oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> this game, bro, it's awesome. Oh, it's gonna lead to the door. Gotcha. This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh, what are you doing? Oh my gosh, there could be like a million Zergs out there, bro. Be careful, think about what you're doing, bro. It could be super dangerous out there. What? So many Zergs. the heck? Look at all these Zerk eggs. They will eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you. The Zerks will get me, for sure. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He'll know that you're a friend. <laughs> we got an outside badge. I'll open the door for you. Bro, I'm so 
scared. I'm sorry, I can't go any further. I'm not as fast. The Zerks will get me. Please find him. Please bring my father back. Learn that one for my little friends. Where are we supposed to go? Oh crap, I see, I see, I see. What the? Okay, and then we're gonna have to go ahead and bounce it back. Come on. That has to be enough. Oh, oh, okay, okay, and then we just go at it. Boom, all right, that's enough. Ah! No, bro. What the heck? I'm just too afraid that these like sink. Yes, sir. Oh no. Yes! Let's go. You get what you deserve. Okay, that was a huge fall. Doc should be nearby. We must be close. Doc, where are you? We need to find you. Good. Ah. Yeah, there we go. Oh, there we go. Oh, there we go. Yes, sir. All right. Can we claw out the door? No, we can't. How to 
disgusting. You nasty little zerks. No way. Is it dog? Dog! Let's go! Whoa! Wait, you're not a Turk. Who are you? That's my badge you're wearing. How did you find it? Did my son send you? Oh, <laughs> Samus, you clever boy. I've been alone here for ages. I came here to test my deflector, but it didn't go as planned. I wish I could go back home. I miss my son dearly. You can have a look around the house if you want, but I have no idea how to escape this place. How to escape this place? Remember. What is this? I've seen humans wear costumes like this. They were small and running around making lots of noise. Oh yes, I remember now, they were children. The streets felt much more alive with them. Even with the difficulty they brought, the adults seemed to love them very much. Doc says he misses Samus. Is that the same thing? Yes, it is. What is this? What? Hey, be careful with that deflector. At full charge, it can explode zerks like confetti. This baby needs 1.21 gigawatt gigawatts to work and the only thing around here with that kind of juice is the generator outside the house the problem is that it won't start i think a fuse blew and with all the zerks around it's too dangerous for me to go out and fix it i'm not fast enough but you just might be if you can reach the generator and replace the fuse it should i should be able to get the deflector recharged come on follow me i'll show you what to do well, all right, let's go ahead. Oh my gosh, bro. What? What, you want something? Huh, you want something? Here, take this fuse. It's brand new. Turning on the generator will be loud, so expect some zerks, uh, of course. Once you fix the generator, it should be able to charge and kickstart the deflector. You just need to follow the cable, change the fuse, then meet me back here. Best of luck. Now nah, I gotta do your dirty work. Here goes nothing. Run! Run! Oh, bet! Bro, be careful with that thing, bro. I don't want to die, too. <laughs> yes, sir. Let's go. Yo. Bro, he knows what's up. Amazing. You got the generator back on. Have you seen how, power, how powerful the deflector is? It's definitely our way out of here. Wait a minute. I might be able to mount the deflector to your drone. What? No way. Bro, be careful. Don't kill that little guy, bro. He's my best friend. It worked, the deflector is now installed on your fancy drum there. It's not meant to run off such a small power source. If you use it too much, it could malfunction. Just remember, it's dangerous. Now let's go back to the village. I'm coming home, son. Yes, sir. Yes, you are. 
Bro, you leaving me? I thought we were all in, I thought we were in this together, bro. Okay. Don't don't be leaving me though. I'm your way out of here. Oh bro, look at these little wimpy dudes, bro. You see in this How do I use it? Take out the Zerg so we can get through. How? L1 to use the deflexer. Oh! Wow, it's working great, but as I suspect, as I suspected, it can overheat. Let it cool for a bit. When that happens, I hope it will last until we reach the village. All right, bro. I got you. I got you. There could be like a million Zerks waiting out there for us, so I'm ready. All right. This switch doesn't doesn't work. It looks like the electricity has been cut. <sighs> of course. Oh, I see. I see. I see. Y'all, this one was so long, I have to make a part two of part two. So, the next one is going to be like 20 minutes long. Expect it soon. It's fire. What happens? But, yeah, this one was like such a long episode. Originally, altogether, this video would have been like 70 minutes long. But, it. I got a message from, or not like a message, like a little text message. No, I didn't get none of that. But um, I got a little pop-up on Share Factory, my editing software. It said um, it has to be under 60 minutes long. So longer I talk, the longer I make it. And I need to stop talking right now. So uh, yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed part one of part two. And part two of part two, gosh, it's confusing, will be coming out probably like minutes after this. So, y'all just wait, all right? Next one's gonna be 20 minutes long, and it will leave you on a cliffhanger just like this one. So, next one will be titled part two of part two. But yeah, this is part one of part two. Y'all yeah. get it, y'all get it. But I'll see y'all in part two of part two. <laughs> I, shut up, Jacob, jeez, deuces.